Right, we're um, back out in the field again. There was uh, an update for BL Heli 32 where you can do dynamic PWM frequency. So instead of just having a set frequency, which I normally put on 48 uh, kilohertz, which is the maximum for most ESCs. Some ESCs will go up to 96 kilohertz, which I think is a little bit over the top to be perfectly honest. But this lets you set a minimum and maximum. I'm gonna try that today. I've updated both my Beta Flight drone and my Falco X1. Both set the minimum PWM frequency to 24 and the max PWM frequency to 48 to see if it makes any difference at all. Now, I did have a bit of an issue with Falco X. It, it flashed three of the ESCs and the fourth one, it completely buggered it up. So I had to plug the, the 4-in-1 ESC into my Beta Flight Flight Controller and update it that way. And it seems to have worked. I've test hovered them. They seem to be fine. But now it's time to really give them hell and see what happens. Hopefully I don't get any desyncs. Let's do this. This one anyways you can see the, the bump you can see you can see it yeah right there do you see that I don't know if that's because of the fly controller but that I don't like that at all no 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 I mean it's it feels smooth only up every other way it's just that bit. Oh yeah, that was terrible that. No, I don't like that. Whoa. I was not paying attention to my throttle control there at all. The motors aren't hot. Right, so we just did um a test of the Falco X with that new BL Heli 32 firmware and uh, it flies alright, it's just got a little bit of a, a shake, like a dip. I wouldn't, I don't know how to describe it, but you'll be able to see it in the footage because I can certainly see it in the FPV camera. Um, and I think that's probably to do now with the fact that it's not, it's not keeping up with the throttle changes that I'm giving it. Uh, I'm going to try the Beta Flight one now. This one should be better because it only runs on 8 kilohertz gyro frequency, so in theory, it should work better. Right, so after that uh, test, yeah, they're both not flying the greatest, to be honest. I mean, they were flying way better before. It's just little things, you can just feel it, like especially when I give a, look, a quite a quick throttle change, it just doesn't feel as locked in as it did. Right, I'm back at home again. I had a bit of an issue out in the field. I can't find my OTG cable anywhere. Um, it's a little cable that converts um, USB to USB-C. I thought I've had it in my bag and obviously I didn't, but it doesn't matter. I'm gonna do it on the computer. It's Let's do this. Right, now for the problem drone. Yeah, see look, it's done it again. It's always on ESC number four that it does this. It just cannot flash number four ESC. I'm gonna have to take it apart 
and plug it back into Betaflight to reflash the firmware on it again. Ugh, what a pain in my ass. Yep, yeah, now it's now it's working absolutely fine. <laughs> I've got one quad on, quad on top of each other and it's uh, I've got the ESC plugged in to the flight controller underneath. Uh, yeah, but it works. Do you want to write current settings? Yes. Right, they are both back together now. Right, we are back out in the field again. Nice open field. Hopefully it's not going to start raining out. Do not look happy. And it's starting to get quite windy out. both work okay now it's just getting too windy out with regards to the new BL heli firmware I reckon it would work well if you actually tuned around it but if you've got a good tune and it's working for you at the moment like I've got I wouldn't even bother changing it to be perfectly honest because it's just not worth it but as of now I'm not going to change over at all my quads are flying beautifully on them 32.7 so i'm just gonna leave it at that i want to get out up into the uh, mountains and stuff like that and start doing some long range stuff and get to some bandos this summer i want to fly some abandoned buildings it's getting really boring around here so yeah anyways peace